Hi guys, this is Marco of Anico with MLM Television, and today I'd like to talk about the few reasons why people fail in network marketing. Most people join a network marketing business opportunity to succeed, and they hear about all the stories about the large incomes and want to be a part of it. Most people want to succeed, but the failure rate is very high. Now let's talk about some of the reasons why people fail in network marketing. Number one, making a list. One of the first things that people are taught to do is to make a list. Make a list of everybody they know. Then they are told to contact those people on their list and tell them about their network marketing business. They are told to share their business with the people on their list and get them to join them in their new business. Most people are told to share their business opportunity with their friends and family, and that's great. Now, if you're really able to succeed in your new business, it's only natural to want your friends and family to share in your success, too. But there's a huge problem in doing this, and it is one of the biggest reasons why people fail in network marketing. And the reason is, none of your friends and family are really interested in your business. Of course they want you to succeed, and of course they all want you to make money. Most people do. But here's the problem. Almost none of these people are actually looking for a business opportunity. So you're trying to sell them on something they're not even looking for. Number two. Getting a company replicated website. Most network marketing companies these days have a company replicated website available for their distributors. They create this amazing website with all the facts and information anybody ever could want. But believe it or not, this is another big reason why people fail in network marketing. These company replicated websites contain company presentations which may be flashy and may even be the best that money could buy. But they are usually designed to simply give out information about their primary business. They only give out information about the company, the products, and the compensation plan. But rarely are they created to actually get people into the business. So they end up looking really nice and really professional, yet they don't get people to join. Of course some presentations do, but most of them don't. So the distributor needs to have the right skills to convince people or persuade them to join their opportunity. Most people simply don't have that skill set. Number three, learning internet marketing. Once people run out of new prospects, it's time to turn to the internet. The internet can be a very powerful tool once you learn how to use it. When you are able to tap into the power of the internet, your business can actually grow faster than ever so you can begin to see success. Learning to use the internet properly is the biggest challenge. Once you know why people fail in network marketing, you can begin to take the necessary steps to help them succeed. Utilizing the power of the internet is one of the biggest steps that can lead people to success. Now once I was finally shown a few of the secrets of internet marketing, I started to see immediate results. I want to help you avoid all the years of frustration that I went through. I want to share what I have learned so you don't have to struggle like I did. My name is Marco Abanico with MLM Television. I'll see you in the next video.